and welcome to the San Siro here in Milan. Home to both AC Milan and Internazionale and the venue for the 2016 Champions League final. And our live game is Paris Saint-Germain against Barcelona. I'm Peter Drury and it's my chance to say that it is an absolute delight to have Jim Beglin beside me. Thanks for the intro, Peter. I've been soaking up the atmosphere and I'm really looking forward to what lies in store. So the players and officials stand tall for the anthem. Paris Saint-Germain have elected to go 4-3-3. Well, it's a system that promotes width, Peter. The wide men can stress defences and just create that running room for others. the whistle so Jim tell me this who are you looking for in particular here well how can I ignore the Brazilian Felipe Coutinho uh, who delivers an awful lot for a little guy great imagination and guile about his work in midfield and in attack he can punch considerably above his weight I'm thinking the same he will be a central feature no doubt Dinha And it's Cavani. Cavani passes it through. Plenty waiting in the middle. He's gone for it! Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. Paris Saint-Germain certainly won't want to look back and, and dwell on that. It was a good chance, though. Rakitic, Alcacer, Thiago Silva, Marquinhos, Di Maria, Daniel Alves, now the pass, he proceeds it all the way, Rakitic, It's Messi, looking to force his way through, has a hit! That really should have hit the net. Dinia. Rakitic tries to get it forward quickly. Steered out wide. Alcacer looking to get on the end of this. Looking to shoot. Good stop. That wasn't easy. Well, what can I say? Truly wonderful goalkeeping. Sergio Busquets shapes the shoot. Chooses to go back. Gets up to head it. Oh, 
surely that deserved better. It was such a clever idea to lift it into his path. Oh, he really wanted that. Yeah, he's been at the centre of a lot of things, hasn't he? Uh, mostly good, I should add. Where to from here? Jordi Alba does well to read it and intercepts. He's got away. He's making good use of his strength there, just refuses to be out-muscled. Traxler. Tries a through ball. Daniel. In with a header! Goal, Paris Saint-Germain! Produced a lovely sequence of passes there. It's a terrific brand of football to watch, and importantly, it has a strong end product. Deadlock broken, it's 1-0. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Draxler. Di Maria. Goes to... It's Di Maria! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. The keeper really dug out his defence then, a magnificent effort. There's a lot of movement out wide now. Yeah, you could certainly see that. Well, I think it's a move to open the game up more, whether out wide or, or just getting a runner through the middle now. Well positioned to make that interception. Looks like a good ball through. Cavani with the delivery. Up to meet it! It's gone a long way up and away. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Danny Alves. Goes for the cross, massive leap! He scores! And they are disappearing out of sight! Well, you know, thinking about that, I think they've perfected that on the training ground because it took them seconds to get the ball from back to front. They really commit forward in numbers too. It was all very well drilled. Saint-Germain get themselves a two-goal cushion. Well, that second goal has given them so much more command and confidence now, and they should be able to take it on from here and either add to their lead... Messi! Messi clearly became one-eyed then. He just decided to force it. He's gone for a throw-in. Intercepts the throw. That's well read. Draxler, and it's Cavani, looks to slip it through, out to the left it goes, going through, Rizal. can he put it away? Rakitic, Marco Verratti, tries a through ball, now it's Neymar! It's Neymar! Philippe Coutinho, aimed long and direct. Messi, Rakitic, Alcacer. Forward it goes. Has he found his man? Just brushed off the ball there. Marco Verratti. It's Danny Alves. Draxler. 
Kurosawa. Rakitic with a good steal, well played. Messi plays it wide. It's been intercepted, and that will come to nothing. Keeper's got good distance on that. It'll be a throw in. And it's Coutinho. Looks to thread it through. Looks like a good ball through. Now surely! And he's shown him a clean pair of heels. Cavani unable to make it happen for all his good intentions. Now it's Luis Suarez. Coutinho. So who's he picking out? Draxler. Luis Suarez. Luis Suarez! He's got away with one there. Messi has been full of enthusiasm and desire, and his work rate has been very strong, and he's, he's clever and been able to read the game almost a step ahead of everyone else. That's great play. Messi did really well to intervene and dispel the growing danger. Alcacer plays it into the channel. Roberto, fine defending there. Referee's had a look, and he's blown his whistle for half-time. Reflections on the first half? Paris Saint-Germain just didn't want the half-time whistle to be blown. Convincing and controlled. Paris Saint-Germain go in at half-time on a comfortable two-goal cushion. Here we go again. And it's Messi. He's away. Over to the left. Lovely feet. Delivers a quick point blank header. And that's caused a worry or two. Yeah, he may have snatched at that a bit, even though it was quite close. They're committing a lot of men forward at the start of this second half. They know that this is an important time for them now. Drexler with the ball through. Just deflected over the goal line for a corner. Stegen maybe was unsighted by his own defence there. Just look at the way the ball sneaked through that defensive line, and I don't think he could pick it up until it was way too late. without reply. This is becoming a stroll. Now the pass. Cut out in the nick of time. Kuzawa. Draxler. Now it's Messi. Alcacer. Messi has embarrassed himself a little there. He'll take some stick in the dressing room for that, I can tell you. Well, I think that might well put him off watching tonight's highlights. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Coutinho passes it through. Draxler. Neymar. 
Kuzawa. There will be a throw in. Thiago Silva. Kuzawa. Tracks the going full steam ahead down the left flank. Roberto goes looking. Now it's Luis Suarez. Iniesta the ball through. Oh, well defended. That had to be done. Out for a throw. He's left his man. Suarez gets into a good position. Can he find a finish now? Time to deliver. That's a brilliant interception. Barcelona making a fresh attempt to release someone in behind from back to front. And this is something different. That had to be more accurate. Someone looks like he's in need of protection here. Yeah, and getting on the score sheet has clearly made him a marked man now. Verretti. Draxler. Kuzawa. Draxler. Looks to slip it through. Another piece of really good defending. And it's Messi. Alcacer tries lifting it over. He could have been in, just needed a better final ball. Uh, that was just poor decision-making and a weak execution. Well played, he saw that coming. A oh, glorious footwork! That looks a good ball. That won't get through. Di Maria tries to get it forward quickly. Barcelona has anticipated a, an aerial bombardment. Just looks like mass defence. Yeah, it's a case of needs must at certain times, Peter, and, and they have to respond to what's being asked of them. Yeah, he's fouled in there. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. Well, you might think he got off lightly, it is just a verbal warning. <laughs> Messi! Tries a through, shot at goal! There is the genius of Luis Suarez! And they are right back within touch. Really outwitted one-on-one. -on -one. Once more, he gets the better of the keeper. Oh, that's excellent composure because the keeper put as much pressure on as he could by not committing sooner. Just a consolation, or is there a way back from here? Kuzawa. Thiago Silva. Di Maria. Daniel Alves. Now it's Cavani. Paris Saint-Germain haven't made a substitution yet. Neymar. Some good play on the left-hand side now to profit from it. Roberto, Messi, now it's Messi, played out to the right, going through, well read, he sorted that out, Marquinhos pushes it out wide, done very well to intervene, now it's Messi, referee has just said play on, Drexler plays it forward, Cavani spreads it towards the left. Too much on that, it's gone out. A 
Sergio Busquets. And it's Messi. Now it's Luis Suarez. Oh, he's broken through. And he's looking at the referee, and the referee is shaking his head. Aimed long and direct. Luis Suarez. Now the pass. He's had a go! Di Maria. Marco Verratti. Iniesta. Forward it goes. It's loose. Who's getting there? And it's Cavani. Looks like a good ball through. He's got away. Can he finish? Goes looking. Iniesta. Jordi Alba. Just five minutes remaining now. Now it's Luis Suarez. He's left his man. He'll have a dip. Cavani plays it out to the flank. He's got options out wide. Going through. Crosses it in low. Philippe Coutinho. It's Luis Suarez. Now it's Messi. Played out to the right. He's left his man. Vidal. Vidal. Messi. And that'll go straight through to the keeper. Neymar looks to dig one in. Iniesta plays it forward. Now it's Messi. Messi. Trout calling for him. Suarez has a go! It's anyone's ball. Messi and a header! And that's that. Paris Saint-Germain always looked the more driven side, probably the better side, and nobody is arguing about the results. How do you look back on the game then, Jim? When you get free-flowing football out wide with consistent supply into the box, it brings excitement and entertainment to the proceedings. That was a brilliant display of, of good wing play for me. This is a performance.